Good afternoon, Facebook, YouTube, Daily Motion, and Twitter. This is Rich again, back for your second video blog of the day for Wednesday, February 4th, 2015, around 2.52 p.m. Battling some mix of sun and clouds today. Highs about 32 degrees. Tomorrow we could get a coating to two inches of snow. Some news to report, ESPN has grabbed the rights to the World Cup of Hockey in 2016, the United States rights. And a surprise, they beat out NBCSN and Fox Sports. And that's about it on that. And my next subject is about WWE Wrestling Challenge. WWE Wrestling Challenge lasted from September 7th, 1986 through through um, December 1996, and WWE Wrestling Challenge was for many years the B program of WWE television. Usually, WWE Wrestling Challenge comprised of a lot of um, major and minor WWE superstars competing in preliminary, pre preliminary matches against jobbers. The jobbers are like local indie wrestlers, and it would take three to four weeks of wrestling challenges and one night at an arena in the United States or Canada. They usually would do this one, they would usually do this the, the next night after they do the big superstars of wrestling TV taping. And a wrestling challenge was hosted for the first three weeks by Gorilla Monsoon and Johnny V and Ernie the Cat Lad but from from like um, the end of September 1986 through March of 1993 with an interruption here and there Gorilla Monsoon and Bobby the Brain Heating were commentating WWE Wrestling Challenge usually they hardly called Sometimes they would never pay attention to the match that much. They would always do their comedy routine and stuff like that. Which was a real big, big thing. Because a lot of people loved um, um, Gorilla Monsoon's and Bobby the Brain Heating's comedy routine. When they were doing um, commentary on wrestling challenge and stuff. Usually wrestling challenge, they don't did not shoot any major angles on WWE Wrestling Challenge and stuff. They would have maybe have a feature match here and there, but no big angles were shot at Wrestling Challenge. Usually the main major angles were shown, shot on the superstars of wrestling. And they hardly had any title changes on WWE Wrestling Challenge. Only one time they had a ch title change on WWE Wrestling Challenge. That was in October of 19. 92 when uh, Money Incorporated, The Million Dollar Man, Ted DVRC, and IRS beat um, Earthquake and Typhoon and Natural Disasters. They would have some interview segments on Wrestling Challenge like The Snake Pit with Jake the Snake Roberts and The Brother Love Show and The Barber Shop with Food and Barber Beefcake and The King's Court with Jerry the King Lala. And it would have like usually um like plugs for the upcoming house shows shown in the WWE markets when they usually interviewed by me and Gene Oakland. And they would always have a special report by Lord Alfred Hayes. Usually, usually like Gorilla Monsoon and Bobby the Brain Heaton were the main announced teams for about six and a half years on Wrestling Challenge, but there was a time for July 1989 through March of 1990, Bobby the Brain Heenan was temporarily off Wrestling Challenge. It was Tony Savani and Gorilla Monsoon. And, but the Brain came back in April of 1990 when Tony Savani went to WCW again. And in April of 1993, Gorilla Monsoon was replaced as host as play-by-play -play host of Wrestling Challenge by Jim Ross. It was Jim Ross and Bobby the Brain Heating for about 
seven, eight months, but that that wasn't the same with Gorilla Monsoon. Then Bobby the Brain Heenan left the WWE. It was JR and Gorilla Monsoon for about two months. Then Monsoon and Stan Lane's. Then Stan Lane and the Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase. Then it was Gorilla Monsoon and the Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase. Then it was Jim Ross and Gorilla Monsoon and then Jim Ross and Doc Hendricks. And Wrestling Challenge stopped airing matches in August of 1995. And, but they still continue Wrestling Challenge. But it was a recap show for, the, for what happened on Raw and Superstars. That lasted for about 17 months before WWE Wrestling Challenge ended in December of 1996. Because they converted a Wrestling Challenge to Shotgun Saturday Night. But that's another story for another day. And, and Wrestling Challenge was seen in the Boston market for the first like four months on WHOL TV 27. Then it moved to Fox 25 in Boston. It, it replaced World Class Championship Wrestling, wrestling um, uh, as its program on that time slot. So Wrestling Challenge took over with the World Class Championship Wrestling time slot. Wrestling Challenge was a great show. It was great to see hear Bobby the Brain Heenan and Girl Monsoon's comedy act and stuff. And the, I miss those squash matches on professional wrestling. They should have more squash matches on Raw or SmackDown. But I think today's wrestling fans would not want to put put up with like squash matches all the time because they could get very boring. But it was interesting TV back then. Well, that's about it on that. My third and final video blog of the night will be about CBS Sports' James Brown. And don't forget Facebook, YouTube, Daily Motion, and Twitter. Coming soon to these video blogs. Julie Potter and Heidi Pratt. See you later.